Hi ho folks, Chris here from the Javelin Tech Team, and in this session I'm going to show you how to disable the dynamic reference visualization functionality that was added to our feature tree in SolidWorks 2015. First off, let's have a little review as to what the dynamic reference visualization functionality does for us within our feature tree. We see here that the dynamic reference visualization tool will dynamically show us the relationships between entities in our SOLIDWORKS file by way of little blue arrows that highlight these relationships in the feature tree. We can disable this functionality manually by right-clicking at the top of the feature tree, choosing our display item from the shortcut menu, and unchecking Show Dynamic Reference Visualization. The setting for showing the dynamic reference visualization is stored within each SOLIDWORKS file. This means that in order to affect that change for all of our files, we would have to save this as part of our SOLIDWORKS template. In order to disable dynamic reference visualization for both your parts and assemblies, you will have to open up your SOLIDWORKS template files and resave them with the Show Dynamic Reference Visualization box unchecked. Once we've made those changes, we'll go in and save our file as a SOLIDWORKS part template, and we'll annotate it specifically so we know that Dynamic Reference Visualization has been turned off. This brings us to the end of today's Tech Tip. We hope this tech tip will be useful to you, and we look forward to seeing you here next time on the Javelin Blog.